Now let me show you what I'm doing. So you got her little head here. Yeah, I've got my sponge. And I put my water on it and my paint on it already. You see the red? That's like, that's actually real paint this time. Not the watered down stuff. And this is even darker than what I have been using. But, you know, when you look at your skin texture and the different, all the different patterns, the different colors, and this is how we do that. And since my head is lighter than any other part of the entire kit, I don't know if you realize, but while I'm doing this, I'm turning this in different directions so that it doesn't create a specific pattern. It has to be as random as possible. And as they build, they, they overlap, they show through. And that's what creates the depth. It's a, a optical illusion. That's what. You can see I ran out of it's still red, but that's fine. You can take your paint. This on here. And I don't have anything where I can. I've got a paper towel over here. But I use to blot any excess. Just barely tap it. So, there's no excess. And then I'm going to go back over the top. Yeah. I don't know. I can see uh, where it's, you can see where it's wet, right? Yeah. But the color that I used is so phenomenally invisible. And on the tops and the bottoms, the insides, the outsides of the ears, because their skin too and across the top of the nose the lips See? that's one and I have to do this with all three colors and it'd be 21 all together three colors seven times.